this is the latest PlayStation 5 bundle, paired with the latest hit from Sony's hitmaker Insomniac Studios. Spider-Man 2 is the biggest PlayStation game this year, so it only makes sense to bundle the game with the console. It'll boost the sales of the game and offer a little bit of good value for those that want to get a PS5 this holiday season. This bundle costs $560, so $60 more than the standalone console. So by buying the bundle, you're only saving about $10. That's not too much. And for $40 more, you could get your hands on the special edition PS5 console with those hard to get Spider-Man 2 faceplates and a special Spider-Man 2 controller. That bundle also does come with the full game. For me, that is a better bundle than this one. So if you could find that one in stock, perhaps spend the extra $40 and get that. Now, when I first saw this bundle, I sort of questioned why it even exists. With the new and updated PlayStation 5 hardware on the horizon, why would someone want to buy this older hardware? After all, the newer PS5 Slim is smaller, lighter, and comes with a larger SSD. The new console also starts at essentially the same $499 for the disc version. So of course, the new PS5 Slim does look better on paper, but not so fast. There's a bit of a deal breaker with that new console. The detachable disk drive on that new console requires an online connection at all times. When I saw that, I was like, what? And that might be a big deal breaker for some. I mean, you need to connect online to play your physical games. That's horrible. So all of a sudden, this standard PS5 disc with the original design suddenly looks attractive. And the box here has all the Spider-Man 2 artwork on the front, the sides, and the back as well. It does say right here that the digital code for Spider-Man 2 is included and not the physical disc. Slide off the sleeve and we get to the inner box and it's packaged like any other PS5. Opening this tab and right on top is the box that contains all the accessories. Here we got a quick start guide, a safety guide. Here's the stand, which is unique for the disc console. You can use the stand to set up the PS5 either horizontally or vertically. Most people, including myself, prefer the vertical position. Here's a high speed HDMI 2.1 cable. Data transfers up to 8K. We got a power cable. Here's the DualSense controller finished in standard white. And there is also a USB cable to charge the controller or connect the controller with your PS5. Then there's the console on the bottom here. Take out that, we can unwrap it. And here's a standard PlayStation 5 disc console. Of course, it has that attached disc drive that does not require an internet connection. It is, however, the newer update model CFI 1215A. The newer version is lighter than the launch edition disc console by 1.3 pounds. It does have a newer chip that produces less heat and is more energy efficient. Performance wise though, you won't notice any differences. Now you're wondering, where is the game? Well, don't throw out the box just yet. The Spider-Man 2 code is just sort of loose in there. Here it is, the download code for full Spider-Man 2 game. Scratch to reveal the code. And that's everything you get in this bundle. The bundle saves you $10. Maybe they should have included the game for free at this point since, you know, the new PS5 Slim is coming out and there's plenty of stock of PS5s around. Anyway, let me know what you think. Will you be getting this OG PlayStation 5 disc console or the new PS5 Slim with a detachable disc drive?